Hey guys, um, I just wanted to talk about why I'm trying to wean off of Twitter and do more here. I'm not going to leave Twitter just because it's a good place to um, check in with what's going on and stay in contact with people, but <laughs> it's a cesspool and uh, I've been sucked into it a few times I, for a couple reasons. It's a cesspool. One is there's the character limit, so you have to condense your thoughts into so many words, so many sentences, and they're usually incomplete or simplistic. And um, you know that doesn't that doesn't cultivate a um, a worthwhile conversation. The other thing is, <laughs> for some reason, the arguments I've gotten in have been with people who agree with me on ninety five percent of the issues, and they get really ugly. And uh, you know, there's sometimes about stupid things like I like national parks. Or, you know, they, uh, they're fine with, um, you know, something that I'm not fine with that's really minor. And we just end up getting in these, like, 30 tweet fights. And it's just stupid because we're allies. Uh, the other thing I've seen is just a lot of vitriol toward, uh, you know, people that are, are supposed to be on our side. Like, uh, I've definitely been disappointed in Rand Paul, but I still consider him an ally. Uh, same with Thomas Massey, you know, I think it's important to call them out when they suck. And Rand Paul, he's one of those guys that's kind of hard because he kind of tiptoes the line of being good. One, one of the less impressive good people or one of the good unimpressive people. <laughs> you know, he, he, he kind of tiptoes that line a lot. But, uh, you know, people saying that he's the worst senator and that uh, we should cancel him and completely ostracize him. And, uh, I mean, who else is close to him in the Senate? Like, um, he's not his dad. He's not a libertarian. But as far as legislation goes or, you know, blocking bad bills, anything like that, he's the only guy who does any of that. So we should, you know, when he is on the right side, we should support him when he's screwing up, we should call him out on it. Um, but yeah, it's just this intense flow of negativity. And I don't think it's, uh, I don't think it's indicative of what the real world is like. I mean, when you talk to people in real life, I just went to the first, uh, libertarian, um, group that I'd ever been, uh, that I'd ever been to. Spike Cohen was here on Tuesday last week and I met a bunch of libertarians and they were like the chillest people ever. We were all cracking jokes and we were having a great time. <laughs> if you go on Twitter, you'd think all libertarians just absolutely hate each other. So I think it's just unproductive. Um, YouTube, you know, I have interviews with people. They're usually half an hour to an hour long. And I try to have people on who disagree with me. Uh, you know, I had Nico House on. I've had a couple people who definitely are not libertarians on the channel. And you can actually listen to an adult conversation between people. And I think it's much more productive than whatever is going on on Twitter. And I, and I was getting way sucked into it because it's really easy to get a lot of followers when you're posting constantly. But I was posting like 20 times a day, getting into all these fights. And it, it's just not productive. It doesn't do anything good for me. It doesn't do anything good for anyone else. I'm definitely not convincing anybody of anything getting into that. So I will still be there. I'll still be you know, posting links to the videos and then probably making like three or four posts a day, but it's going to be way dialed down because as I've just laid out, it, um, you know, it condenses your thoughts into one tweet and it's very misrepresentative of what you're trying to say. Sometimes unless you write an entire, um, thread, what you are saying yourself can be misunderstood by someone else to mean something completely different. So it's just dumb. So I'm, I'm done with it. Um, as a major outlet, I'm just going to use it for keeping in contact, posting videos and, uh, you know, seeing what's going on. Uh, but just letting you guys know. All right. Thanks.